Khabib confesses nerves as Eagle FC impresses in U.S. debut. Khabib Nurmagomedov, the former undisputed UFC lightweight champion, acknowledged he still has a lot to learn about the other side of the fight industry after his Eagle FC combat promotion made its U.S. debut in Miami on Friday night. Nurmagomedov hasn't felt the unique blend of emotions that comes with being a fighter since his final career bout against Justin Gaethje a year and a half ago, but ahead of Eagle FC's first show on U.S. soil, he said that strange mix of nervousness and excitement that all fighters have felt at one time or another has returned. Today when I wake up I was nervous like I'm going to fight tonight, he told MMA Junkie in advance of the fight card. I have same feeling today when I wake up. I realized I'm not going to fight, I have a fighting show. It was a very nervous day, but right now I'm happy. He didn't have to be concerned. Sergei Koyedinov, another renowned figure from Russian MMA and one of the sport's most seasoned veterans, headlined the card, mauling kickboxing star Tyrone Splunk. Perhaps it was fitting that Karidinov's triumph came via the same oppressive top control and ground and pound tactics that Khabib had mastered during his rise to the top of the sport. Rashad Evans, the former UFC light heavyweight champion, won a decision over Gabriel Keiko in what was the American's first win in the cage since beating Chael Sonnen all the way back in 2013, ending a five-fight skid that prompted him to retire from the sport after a knockout loss to Anthony Smith in 2018. Ray Borg, a UFC veteran and former championship challenger, also excelled, shutting down the experienced Cody Gibson and winning the judges' decision. Following that, Borg made a point of thanking Khabib for his participation. Khabib, thank you for me on your show man, he said post-fight. I couldn't be more happier to fight for your show. I've had a lot of ups and downs in my career, and I appreciate you giving me the opportunity to come and do what I love. The Miami event marked Khabib and Eagle FC's latest step in growing the organization outside Russia and the neighboring territories to become the newest big-name player on the global MMA scene. They've stated that fighters from all four corners of the globe will take center stage at upcoming events as they try to expand and add more ballast to a brand that has already attracted a lot of attention thanks to Khabib's involvement. Khabib was warned by the man who catapulted him to the top of the sport, UFC President Dana White, that his new role would not be easy, a lesson White predicted Khabib would learn the hard way. Rather than making an enemy of his now rival, Khabib stated that he plans to learn from White rather than dismiss his advice. To be honest, nothing, about promotion, is easy, Khabib stated. Dana White, he is correct. I'll be meeting with him in Las Vegas next month. I'm going to have a lot of conversations with him about all of this. I'm just getting started. How many years of experience does he have? He's the finest in the game, and learning from him is a huge honor for me. Thanks for watching. Please consider subscribing to the channel.